Look at how cute my mug is. Ignore how pushed up it is. But I got the like cutest mug like last week, like this week, earlier this week. It's so cute. I got it from this place called Accent and Co. It's at the well. Like if you guys watch my birthday vlog, um we went there just to like look at it. If you don't know what it is, it's like this new outdoor mall in Toronto, front in Spadina, like intersection. It's so like I don't know, I have a lot of thoughts about it, but it's so cute. I love it so much. It's like literally what gets me excited to like make my coffee in the morning. And honestly, I'm here for anything that's gonna wanna get me up and going. Uh, it's currently 1.30, no 11.30. I'm getting ready to go to a yoga class. I have a yoga class at 1 p.m. today. So I'm just trying to get ready. I want to leave my place around 12. <sighs> so I can get there on time. It's not too far, but I just want to be on time. It's also cold. And I just want to like, I don't want to feel like rushed and everything. So I just want to be on time. I'll be honest with you guys. Today's Saturday, but I didn't have like a really great week. Aside from my birthday, I think I was just taking, like just so super excited about my birthday and it made me like feel like off track for the rest of the week which i don't want to like go into too much details on and i've just kind of like been feeling really bad about it since yesterday but this morning i just took the time to just like sit and write down my thoughts i also did a journal for the most of last week or this past week or this past week given that we're at the end of the week you get what i mean and i did that today so it was just like really nice and I just really, really miss journaling. And as I was journaling, I was journaling about how I feel about certain things. Like it's been hard for me to like, want to get into creating in terms of like editing my videos, making new videos. It's just like, I've been in my head a lot. And I was journaling and I started thinking about, oh, this is why I wish this was like this or that was like that. Then I remember this TikTok. If I find it, I would put it on the screen, but basically reminding me that you need to be in a constant place of um appreciation and he gives like this triple a formula acknowledge what you have not what you do not have appreciate what you have and allow what's like what's next to come yeah basically that and he goes on to say that if you're not in a constant state of appreciation you're in a like vibrational frequency of like not having and so you're gonna stay in that level of not having. That's all about like how we choose to perceive life. It was just like a big reminder for me to just focus on the things you have and appreciate those things and focus on that and just and like accept what is happening. I've spoken about acceptance before. I have a whole video on it. And when I tell you guys that when I make all these like sit down videos, it's really for me because these are the lessons that I am learning through life. And sometimes I find that the best way for me to learn is to talk about it and not teach because I'm not a teacher. Like, no, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm just a girl, you know, I'm just a girl. That song has been stuck in my head for so long, I don't know why. Before I chat too much, I'm gonna get ready for my yoga class. I've been loving my lattes or like a little cappuccino. I don't know if this is gonna qualify for a cappuccino, but I think I'm gonna leave my hair in this headband for my workout. Even going for yoga, I was like, I didn't really work out as much and I was like, I don't really deserve to go to yoga. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, that's how I literally think sometimes and it's like sometimes i feel like i have to earn like some of the things that i do like i have to earn like to go and spend some time at a yoga class because it's like i worked hard so i have worked so hard for the most part of the week and it's time to like release everything but 
life is not like that it cannot be like that. i kind of have two options for yoga class uh, i've tried to show you guys one sec this is option number one it's like flare leggings you guys can't really tell but when i put it on you probably would and i have this one shoulder top from sit active i honestly adore this top i think it's so cute i think the one shoulder just does it for me i also have this free people tank that i barely wear kind of want to wear the tank because it's warmer and it's colder today i'm feeling kind of shaky i'm not gonna lie and this is kind of why i switched to like decaf coffee i've just been really needing caffeine so i don't know about like my dilemma with like leggings but flare leggings i can do leggings make me so itchy but this one that i have from aritzia it always shifts like it's never in the middle and it drives me crazy every time i have to put it on this is the fit the bottoms are pretty much flared please don't look at my feet now it's time to figure out what i'm gonna layer with I wore this yesterday, so I'm gonna wear this again. Let me check what time shirt card is coming. Only nine minutes, so I think I can make that one. I kind of have matching bottoms for this like sweater, so I'm gonna wear that.
can not hear me or in the shower, but I'm literally about to shower. And I don't know why, but I've been breaking out here for some reason. I don't know. I think I saw a bed ball on the TTT today. And like I've been super conscious about it. And now like I just took off all of my clothes, like everything that I wore today and I threw it into the laundry, put in my bag, everything, girl. It's like no. Nah. and I'm just making dinner I've been editing at least we got something done I'm not done editing quite yet I just put the music <laughs> now it's time for the like transition text whatever okay I'm making lemon chicken orzo or something I saw the recipe on Instagram so I'm just gonna be making that I'm excited. I don't know why I have so much energy. Yeah, I'm not sure why I have this much energy, but we're going with it. We are going with her. Like, oh my god, you guys, this song, you guys. Ah! I used to be so crazy about this song when it, like, it first dropped. It was like. I felt so cool because nobody really knew her too. Like, you tell me you love me, but I am just living it daily. There's nothing you can ever hide. Already got the screenshot. This song has me in a choco world. Like, uh, <laughs> I love him so much. I'm waiting for this to get hot. I just watched that back and I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. Let's cook, yo. Let's cook. Okay, I'm waiting for the chicken, like the oil to get hot so I can put the rest of the chicken in. Like, you see her? She's just sizzling and she's not she's not super hot yet. And it's like Sis, you're keeping me waiting. I need to cook. I need to cook. Okay, what song should I listen to next? I can't listen to a song that's gonna get me all riled up because I'm not gonna cook. 